Hi everyone. Thank you for spending a few minutes with me. My name is Jay Davis and this channel is all about juicing, DIY, and self-care. I would love if you would just hit that little button right there. No, right there. That little subscribe button. Hit that for me. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share. I would really, really appreciate that. It allows me to make this type of video just to share the knowledge. Okay, today this uh, video is all about something we can do to care for our skin. We all love beautiful, glowing skin. It's simple. It's in, almost in the recipe. is in almost in everybody's home. I almost guarantee you have at least one of these items in your home right now. It's a simple DIY mask that you can uh, apply to your skin that would give you healthy, glowing, beautiful skin. Let's jump into it and see what this is all about. So here we go. All right, let's get started. Now this mask has everything probably you already have in your home. There are simple ingredients that work so well and is so beneficial to the skin. The first ingredient is just simple petroleum jelly. We're going to use first petroleum jelly, toothpaste. This particular one is Colgate, but any toothpaste that's white, has a white paste you can use for this, uh, for this mask. And our favorite for the day is baking soda, just plain baking soda. Baking soda have so many beneficial uses in the home, in the garden, and for your skin. But for the day, we're going to use it for our anti-aging face mask. All you need is one teaspoon of petroleum jelly. So I'm going to put that in the, on a bowl. The bowl don't necessarily have to be a glass bowl, but in a container. So we're going to scrape that in the bowl. One teaspoon of petroleum jelly. And then you're going to need your, your toothpaste, okay? And because we're making a paste, you're just going to squeeze, I wouldn't say a toothpaste, but just squeeze some toothpaste into the mixture. Maybe about one, tooth, one teaspoon and a little bit more. The next thing we're going to need, I'm going to say two teaspoonful of baking soda. One, oops, so half of that since some already fell. Two. And just stir your baking soda, your toothpaste, and your petroleum jelly. Just stir it around until it come to until you end up with the paste. So stir it for maybe three minutes. So let's give that a go. Okay, that should be about it. Everything should be white, creamy, with sort of a paste-like consistency. This is what it looks like. Just paste, okay? Now I'm gonna, we're gonna put that. My face have been washed and clean. I have no makeup on. And I'm just going to spread it all over my skin. I'm taking it off and applying it to my face. Okay. The first time I used this uh, mask, I was overjoyed with the way it feel. You can feel a little exfoliation going on and it just spreads on. And you can feel the way it 
cleans your face. Make sure you get the side of your nose, the top of your nose, the middle of your forehead. Move that back some. This is just to protect my hair. And just spread it all over your face. Let's put it on. Oops, take that off. Okay, we're just going to keep spreading it on. Now, oh, that feels so good. Rub it around. Now, if you like, you can use a small brush to increase the exfoliation. But for me, just using it, my fingers serve the same purpose. Now, once your face is covered, your neck, make sure you apply some on your neck. And all you have to do is let it sit for about 15 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes, and then I'm going to head to the shower and wash it off. So I'll be back in about 20 minutes. Okay, just remember you only need three ingredients. That's baking soda, petroleum jelly, and toothpaste. I just happen to be using this one, but any white toothpaste will give you the benefit that you're looking for. And you will love the smell as you rub it into your skin it's simple, it's inexpensive, and it does work. I hope you benefit from this. I hope you learn something new. And if, you, if you've if you used baking soda before, let me know. Maybe I can incorporate that into some of my routines. And we can share. Thank you for stopping by. Please remember to subscribe, like, and share. And until the next time, Thank you.